Hey guys, it's me Heidi. Um, today, oh, I hope everybody had a good couple of weeks. Sorry, I've been away. Um, today we are doing the yummy mummies. So today we are trying the uh, chocolate bars and the gummies. So let's get started. Okay, so today we are starting out with the chocolate. Um, we'll do it first because it needs to melt and stuff. So you get a tray, and the tray has different chocolate stuff you can do, and then you get the packages of the chocolate, which will open. Um, one's dark, and one's white chocolate, so it doesn't matter. So whatever your sweet tooth is, or you prefer, you can use it. So here are the bags that you need and they gave us some paper to put the chocolates in and you get a knife, little plastic knife which is cute. Um, yeah, so we will open the first bag and see what's inside. So, I think I'm gonna cut. Oh, yay! Okay. So this is bag number one. And bag number one will have whatever chocolates are in here. I think these are the dark ones. Yeah. Dark chocolate. And then what we are going to do, oh, make sure they're all going down to the bottom. And then I have a bowl over here. Oh, uh, I have a bowl over here that's filled with hot water. You will need hot water for it. Um, so just be mindful of that because you need to melt the chocolate. So this is the dark, the light one. This is the light chocolate. So let's get this. I should have had this already done. Then you want to be able to see the process. Okay, so while those are waiting and melting, leave those in there for a little bit. Um, we will go over to the gummies and we'll get the gummies started because they take some time to. Um, to do. So for the gummies you get the powder, you get a petri dish with a shovel and a spoon. This is so cute. And then the tray for that one is this so that's what you mix the stuff in, and then that's what you get for the molds. So we will open packet number one. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to do this, actually. Do it on here. Ooh. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. Okay. So the instructions for the gummies is um, so you take two scoops of the powder And you put it in each one. Um,
Okay, so now here's the second one. The second packet that I'm opening. I'm hoping... Oh, it all fell down. Sweet! And they actually smell, like the powder smells really good. Okay. Like the powder smells good, so. That's always a good sign when the powder smells good, then usually the food tastes good. So right now we have, so this is a, ras I didn't even look at it, that says there's a raspberry, um, as a, but I'm, the one that I'm opening up now is a raspberry flavor, so we'll see how it goes, and I'm sure that you can like mix the flavors, actually I'm going to try that. Okay, so there we have it, and then you add four scoops of water. So I'm just going to use the water from the, uh, that I'm using for the chocolate. And then one, ooh, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four. Okay. So that's the four. Then I guess you need your spoon. And it says you have to mix it until there's no clumps. Oh, shoot. Be very careful because it is messy. Hmm. It doesn't taste that bad. <laughs> the water doesn't even taste that bad. It tastes like lemon. So yeah, make sure there's no clumps, no bumps, no nothing, because then you gotta scoop it all out and pour it in the mold. So you really don't want clumps. Come on, come on. It's taking forever with the clumps. Okay, so not to stop for everybody. Do one color at a time because the more that the powder sits, the longer it takes 
to get all the clumps out. And you think I'd use hot, I used, this is hot water, warmish water. So you'd think that it would have dissolved quite easily, but apparently not. And doesn't tell you, like the, the instructions don't tell you like what you have to use. Okay, I think that's done. Hmm. Uh, okay, so I'm still, so I turned off the camera for a minute to save battery because I'm still working out the clumps for the straw, uh, the cherry. So the flavors that we did get was cherry, blueberry, which is the blue, obviously, and tropical punch. But the tropical punch kind of tastes like lemon to me. I don't know. It might taste something else for you guys. Might might taste the punch that I don't. Okay. Okay, so yeah. I'm just gonna take the scooper or the the shovel. And I'm just gonna pour Okay, so this is the last bit of that. So this is what it will look like when it's all done. Yeah, it's kind of runny and whatever, but I'm going to put this in the fridge for 15 minutes and then I will be back and we can do the chocolate. Okay, so now that the gummies are in the fridge waiting to go, I uh, will do the molds for the chocolate. So let's start with this one. So I'm just going to snip that off. And then pour or salt squeeze the chocolate oh, this is really hard oh my goodness Knead it down pretty much. <sighs> Come on. Holy moly, this is hard. Okay, I think that's enough chocolate in that one. I uh, get out the trusty knife and just kind of like, I'm just going to try and like pat this and spread it. Oh yeah, I have more than enough. Okay, so 
that was the white chocolate. I'm gonna do a little bit different. I'm gonna do it di differently for the dark chocolate because um, these two didn't really get a lot. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to oh that came out a lot quicker than the dark did and the, the the white chocolate did I see like the dark chocolate is more melted so I guess I didn't really give the white chocolate enough time to um to melt than the dark chocolate because the dark chocolate kind of had longer time than the uh, what do you call it? Uh, okay, so this is it. This is the chocolate, and I'm gonna try and turn this over. So there you see it. That's what it'll look like after it's done. So this is it. Uh, this goes in the mic. This goes in the fridge for five minutes. So, when we come back, they should be done and ready to go. Hey guys! Okay, so, I had to reshoot this last part of the video just because it didn't go so well when um, I was editing this video. So, this is how the gummies turned out at the very end. And, like, while they're still in the dish, I'm sure they don't have the chocolate ones because they're already out but let me try and find a good one this is what the white chocolate came out looking like and this is what the dark oh try to find a good dark one this is what the dark chocolate came out like so that was pretty cool and then um i'm gonna try and popping out one of these so that we could kind of like see how they turned out so I'm going to use my knife and let's try um, popping out haha -ha. okay so that is what the gummies look like and you know they're actually like gummy and that one's an owl so we're going to taste it Nice egg head. Hmm. It's really good. Actually tastes like a gummy. That's awesome. And we're gonna test now, we're gonna test the chocolate. Hmm. Chocolate's not bad. Mmm. It tastes like um dollar store candy like chocolate like the really like cheap stuff it's so good though it's so really good um so I will rate I'm rating these I'd say about a nine because the gummies I can actually make a lot more than I can with the chocolate like I've actually you I did actually use um, the chocolate mold for gummies and actually made more gummies and I still have another batch left to make more gummies I can still make more gummies that's awesome um, excuse me as I'm taking I don't know what happened there with the gummies but anyway yeah so um if there's anything you guys want me to try, then let me know in the comments down below. Subscribe and give it a thumbs up for this video. Um, yeah, just comment me uh, whatever I can do, like whatever like you guys want me to try. Uh, I'll definitely try it. I'll find it, try it, and we'll see how it goes. So I wish you guys a, a good night, and I will see you next week. Bye!